it is about time that our region has a network of its own. We must include more women, not only in time of conflicts, but throughout the whole spectrum of peace, from preventive to resolution. An out-of-the-box thinking would imply a less gendered stereotypical representative and more of women active roles in broader yet central issues of conflict resolution. This will stimulate courageous conversation not only to understand the root causes of grievances but also the seeds to peace building. Women are active peace builders, mediators, tribal and community leaders. I've met and worked with many of them as a civil society actor myself as well as former government negotiator for talks with the Moro Islamic Liberation Front. The Southeast Asian network of women negotiators and mediators shall harness this immense energy of the women in the region. It will bear pressure on the powers that be to make peace and to make peace processes inclusive. It's time for us to rethink the way that we respond to conflict. It's time for us to consider new models of mediation it's time for us to move beyond big man mediation and multi-track diplomacy. The Southeast Asian women mediators are going to provide such leadership to rethink about hierarchical approaches to mediation, to think about how we bring together stakeholders in dialogue towards sustainable and lasting peace. Mediation is never an easy undertaking. It is one that requires an extraordinary amount of patience. It requires the willingness to take risks and it requires believing that you can rebuild trust where trust has been broken or where it never existed in the first place. I welcome the establishment of the Southeast Asian Network of Women, Peace Negotiators and Mediators, and I'm truly honored to be part of it. Today, we can see the contribution of women in maintaining peace, especially the role of female mediators in community conflict. I'm proud to be a woman mediator from Timor-Leste and involved in the Southeast Asian network of women peace negotiators and mediators as we could engage more female mediators in peace process in the country and originally. I'm very honored to be part of Southeast Asian network of women peace negotiators and mediators. And I'm totally believe that the inclusiveness and meaningful participation of women will gain recognition, security, belongings, well-being to our people, not only in Southeast Asians, but in worldwide.